Hi, I'm Anita Potter from Anita Potter Productions, and today we're going to take a look at how you can extend your MIDI item without looping the track. As you can see, I have a MIDI item here that just has like four bars of chords, like a four bar chord progression, if you will. And when I try to drag the right out, it will start looping. And I don't want that. So what I'm going to do, and I'm just going to extend it right there just to show you what happens. Right click on the track, go to item settings and unselect loop item source and it will stop looping. So I can just go ahead and just drag this out as far as I want. But you may want to have your track to loop. So I'm going to right click and I'm going to turn the loop item source back on and see it's right there. But if that starts too far, I want it to start right here. So what I'm going to do is at the end of these notes on the right, I'm going to place my left click my playhead right there and I'm going to hit S to slice. And then I'm going to go ahead and delete the extra to the right. And then I'm going to drag this back out. So now it will loop. And you can tell it's looping by the notches. Let me color this track better so you can see it in a purple color. As you can see right there where my mouse is, there's like little notches at the top and bottom of your audio track that shows you where the track is looping. Because it usually if it starts right here. But if you had it like this, then you had stuff. See, and it loops that way too. So if you had like a track that was like, way out there and you wanted to drag it back more you can loop it back to the left and as far as you want to the right whichever floats your boat if you have any comments or questions please leave them in the comment section below and i'll see you in the next video bye bye for now